the person who drives meaning drives the tribe. Let's talk about the myths of engagement for a minute. In the previous generations, we, my generation, were told that engagement comes by giving you a bigger salary. And so we've thrown way too much money at millennials. And they don't give a shit because they'll walk away for a job that is pays less. And we're like, huh? That doesn't make sense. Of course it makes sense. Where did they go? Well, they went to work for a leader. Who cares about them? They went to work for a leader because it wanted to know who they were and what their dreams are and what their goals were and why did, what, what, where were they on the, the planet? It wasn't just good enough to pay more. We want purpose in our lives. So how do you find the purpose of your life is a really important question. And it's one I want to challenge you to do. Because if I come around now and ask you what your purpose is, there's a pretty good chance you won't know. Not because there's something wrong with you, but because we don't live in a society that's given that enough value yet. Millennials and Gen Z are doing that. They're bringing that forward. So I want to give you the first clue in this, in this myth. So money doesn't do it. Money is not going to create the engagement. Meaning creates the engagement. So you might want to write this down. The person who drives meaning drives the tribe. The person who drives meaning drives the tribe. So what does that mean? It means if the meaning is very clear, and by that I mean emotionally connected, then other people can hook into it. But if we're living in a society that has told us that doesn't matter, then we, we sort of keep it sneaky in the back. It's like, you know, like that, that smoker, you know, oh, I don't smoke, but they're out back every moment when nobody's noticing. And it's kind of like that with meaning. We push it in the back. 